This program contains strong language, sexual scenes, and references from the outset and throughout. The longest relationship any of us have been in? We need lifelong friends. Fell in love. I want you to be last. Yes! Will you marry us? Yes! Fell out. <laughs> You're a fucking psycho! <laughs> and broke each other's hearts. I don't think I can do this. Fuck you. I've liked you more than you have ever liked me. It's literally been five years of... Look and mint. Get more. Touching on. And a shitload of fucking... Oh. <sighs> We've grown up together. Having the time of our fucking lives. <laughs> Get back inside, you said a This time, because it's been five years, things are totally different. The house is split the two. Team Gary versus <laughs> Team Charlotte. Team Charlotte! Team Charlotte! It's Geordie War. <laughs> it's a massive competition. <laughs> to throw the best nights in Newcastle. No one wants to be on the losing team. Yeah, we've got a damn concern about that. And look who's back to join the battle. Oh, 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 oh. Bring it on. I should have a degree in pulling women. I would never kiss anyone without a six pack. My biggest fear is getting wrinkles. I'm thick and flirty. The hardest craft I've ever done is do me hair. I am a Geordie girl with a VIP edge. Just doing the best not to me. I could talk the back legs off a donkey. Got the looks, got the charm. I've got a banging body and the banner to match. I'm going to tear the place up. I'm a natural beauty. If you look up pulling in the dictionary, I'm there. I'm full of mischief. I'm going to get everyone feisty. I'm real and I'm Raj. I'm preened to perfection. Equipped. I'm crack as me like. Anna's ringing. What could she possibly want this time? I hope she doesn't want to hang out because that would be weird. Hello? Hi, Charlotte. It's Anna. I need to pack the ASAP and back to the house. We well, just got back out. I'll tell you more about it when I see you. Can you let all the others know, please? Right, OK, bye, Anna. Shit. We're going back to the house. I've got to tell the others. I need to pack. I haven't even washed my hair. <laughs> eh? Anna's asking us back already. I don't know what she's got planned, but it must be something big. Feeling rather excited. Don't do anything your mother wouldn't do. I've got no idea why Anna wants us back so soon. The only thing I can think of, she wants a fucking new Mercedes. Come right. on, let's go. Oh shit, we trombone. You what? We trombone. Let's do this! We're single now. Last time around, me and Gary made a pact to stay single. I can't believe we actually did it. This time around, the world is mine and Gary's oyster. Are you going to fall? No. Well, why not? Because uh, it's what happens with us first, isn't it? <laughs> it's been a long time since me and Charlotte have both been single. I'm excited and I just want to see where it goes. Like, all I know, right, is that I think you look very handsome right now. You look pretty, too. That's a fucking lie. <laughs> it's not. You look really nice. You do. That'll be me new nose. So excited to get back in that house. And I'm even more excited because this time I'm going in with Aaron. I feel very confident about the place that we're in at the minute. I just hope we can carry it on. I'm not going to go and pull. Just see how things go. And then maybe get to have sex. Be a good boy, maybe. So soon, what is going on? Where's my man? I'm climbing! Me, you want 
the safe in this city. Marty Mack is going back. I'm scared, I don't know why. This is it, we're back, I'm buzzing. Right, you ready? Go. Two minutes and the house has had a massive makeover. It looks unreal. <laughs> oh. Back in the shag pad. So me and Aaron get to the house and we're both buzzing. I just can't wait to get in and see who's in there. Hello? Who's that? Me and Gary are in the shag pad getting really cosy. And then Marnie and Aaron walk in. Force him. It's a full on bar. Should we go and get? Should we go and get? Come on. God knows why Anna's got us back, but I am buzzing to see these two. I cannot wait to get back into the house. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, Aaron. You scared the shit out of his dickhead. <laughs> Chantel's back. And she's looking as gorgeous as ever. Her hair is so curly, but it looks like she's wearing super noodles on her head. It looks very sexual. <laughs> well, I've got Cheers. a massive one. Right, news, lovebirds. I feel like a fucking spare wheel. Thank God, I can get a car pulling up. It's time to walk back to the house. I'm so fucking excited. Whoa. Walk one, bitches! <laughs> It's Nathan. Who follows after? Fucking Chloe with a trombone. What a fucking dafty. You know how I'm not very good at sucking the dick? So it's a two-task job. It's at the same time you're whacking off and you're blowing. She can't do it. If she wants lessons in that, she should just come to me. <laughs> Saggy sack, Marty Mac is back. <laughs> Marty looks unreal. He does look like he's going to a funeral, but so fuck, so do I. Marty, Marty, Marty. Oh. 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 If Marty's going to spew every time he has a shot, he's not going to last two seconds in this house. Yeah, I wonder where Holly is. Where is she? But I tried to ring her and she just didn't answer. <gasps> so she paid you. Charlotte can't get over Holly. She better get her act together and get to this fucking house before Anna arrives. We've been that obsessed with the bar, we haven't even read the note of Anna. Maybe we'll find out what the fuck is going on. Welcome back to the house. I know it's so noticed. Scott will be joining you soon, and there's no work tonight, so take the night off. I'll see you in the morning. I've got some very, very big news. Shit, Anna's got some big news. What the hell can it be? Don't be too hungover. <laughs> yes! See off my fucking tits, me! <laughs> Anna, you think we're not going to go party on our first night out back? Are you mad? To the first night. We're back. To the first night. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Everyone is looking on the fleek. So it's time to bounce to Bijou and fuck that place up. I cannot wait for a night. Yes! Live on that TV! We get to Bijou and it's fucking bouncing. I am buzzing to be back. First night back. I might have a boyfriend, but I still know how to party. I don't know what it is, but me and Chloe are like magnets. On a night out, we we'll always end up just coming together. <laughs> oh. Me and Aaron are getting on so good, and I'm really liking where we are at the minute. It is weird, me and Charlotte being back in this house and both being single, that hasn't happened for a very, very long time. I need to tell her how I feel. Me and Gary have went back and forwards now for five years and he's telling me that I'm one of the reasons that he split up with Lily and that is huge. I am never, ever, ever nervous around girls, but even after five years, for some reason, I get nervous around her. You I'm supposed to believe that Gary Beadle gets shy and nervous around me, 
With me and Charlotte at the minute, things are up in the air. Only thing I know is, when I look at her, I know that I really like her. Marty Stadson does turn me on a lot. And, like, the River Tines down there, pure wet. His nipples are on show, and I'm feeling a little bit peckish. Then I think I'm just going to get in for the scrum. Nathan is absolutely smashed. Chloe and Marty can't even walk. It's definitely time to head back to the house. I think this is Marty's first step to being a gentleman. He's carrying me shoes out of the club. That's marriage material. First night back, and Anna told us not to get too drunk because we've got some big news tomorrow. Oops. What's going on, Bobby? <laughs> After playing Nathan a little tune on the trombone, I feel a bit sorry for him, so I'm going to try and get the idiot into bed. Are you anything to you? Look. The old me would have had Charlotte in the shag pad on the first night, but something feels different this time. I don't want to fuck things up by just jumping straight back in a bed together. Hi, Gary. <laughs> me and Chantel are both mortal, and we're having such a good time. I never thought we'd be this close. <laughs> Bra and knickers soak and wet. We need to get to bed. <laughs> Who would have thought it? I've ended the night in the shag pad and I'm not even shagging. Let's just hope I'm not too hard that tomorrow for Anna's big news. Aye. Anna's finally gonna tell us this big news. Things are gonna be very different. No! Really? This is competition now, this is war. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> There's strong language and sexual scenes in this part, so if you're easily offended, stop watching. Charlotte, you can really see them bruises now. I know it was worth it for the nose, but your nose is on fleek. I've got a new nose, I'm bruised to shit, but I love it. Last night was good, though, wasn't it? I know that you and Gary have got something really special. Cos I was going to be straight at one point. I know you were. Cos it was a quite a successful night, all in all. Mm. But I did miss Holly. Yeah, she was weird on not being there. Holly better get her ass back to this house soon. And I'm keeping everything crossed that if she does, it means her and Kyle are finally over for good. <laughs> Last night was hectic. My head is fucking lifting. I feel a bit rough for me, like. I do. I'm fucked. Guys, we in bed with Sean last night. Literally went in, cuddled her, said night at night, and then just came with you. Last night, for once, I was just honest and open with Charlotte and told her exactly how I feel. We were talking last night, right? Actually, like, <laughs> man's went deep in Bijou. <laughs> so I heard God came down, like, a lot, because I actually spoke to her, honestly. So I just want to actually know what she is, like, actually feeling. I love the idea of Charlotte and Gary being together, and now they're both single, what's stopping them? I'm going to get a shower. Shower, cup of tea, wait for fucking that slag, Anna. I can't wait for Anna to turn up and tell her what we're actually doing here. For once, give us some good news and not bad news, you miserable twat. What do you think's gonna happen today then? Because I'm telling you now, Anna's gonna walk in. She will. We need to find out what the fuck we are doing here. I just hope Anna doesn't walk through that door with that shit spray tan and send us on some wank job. She did say yesterday, don't bring me over. I'm not. I'm fucked. Bye. Oh my god, it's Holly. I am so happy to see her. 
Jullie ook ooit mee al? Ja. Ik heb een beetje 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 een Like, this was also very short voice. I know. You do look good, mind. Yeah, Thank you. Yes. What's going on? Are you single? Oh, God. Right. I knew this question was going to come up. Me and Kyle aren't together anymore. It was a horrible time and it proper upset us. But I just don't want to get into it with this lot. I know they won't understand. So, um, yeah, I'm single. Yeah! It's about time! Holly is finally single now, so hopefully this means she can have fun and let her hair down without all the drama. Now that Holly's here, we're all just sitting around waiting for Anna to turn up. Oh. oh. Hi, everyone. Hi. Oh, you look like a black current. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck has Anna got on? She just walked in looking like a giant fruit pastel. Listen, thanks for coming back with such short notice. Can you guys come and join them on the couch here, please? So Anna's finally gonna tell us this big news. What is it, Anna? You've really got a cock. This time round, things are gonna be very different. What do you mean? Well, after five years, because I've had enough experience to stop messing around. What does she think we've been doing for the last five years? Like, just shagging and getting pissed. I work hard. Well, so what does this mean? I want you to run your own party nights. <laughs> no! Yeah? What? We're going to run your own party nights. This is going to be fucking lethal. You're going to be split into two teams, and you're I'm both going to get a club venue. It is a competition, yeah. Charlie. Oh, my God, this is amazing. This could be the first job we actually enjoy. Wait, who decides the team? Charlotte, I'd like you to run one team. Yes! I am a captain of my own team. Just feel like God right now. Gaz, can you take the other? <gasps> Enemies. Me and Charlotte are already complicated enough, but to just spice things up even more, Anna decides to give us our own teams to go head to head. Really? I'm a little bit scared of what this is going to... Like, do to Charlotte. Competition brings out a nasty side. Gary and Charlotte are very competitive, and none of them will fucking want to lose. Well, I'm going to be keeping an eye on you all as well to see who's the best team, OK? There will be a big prize for the winning team, and I've got a few surprises lined up for you all. Woo! I love surprises! <laughs> what could the surprise be, Anna? That you're going to retire and finally fuck off? Choose your teams, come up with your themes, your first one's tonight. <gasps> what? what? That's so fast. What? We haven't even got time to prepare. How can I get things in order? I'm starting to panic. God, I can't let this get the better of us. Listen, don't fuck this up, OK? Oh. Bye. <laughs> Shit. That's the first time I've heard Anna swear. Bye. Bye, Anna. Bye. I'm fucking pure excited for the need. If there's one thing I can do best, it's getting people in a club and partying like a fucker. This is competition now. This is war. <laughs> I can't lose to Charlotte. Like, I just can't. Everyone! Come on! Tonight, me and Gary have got to host our own club night going head to head. We haven't got long, so it's time to pick which of these idiots are going to be in our teams. This is nothing personal. This is a competition, and I want to win. I'm not going to be going pussyfooting around and picking me best friends. If you're not strong enough, you're not getting in. I mean, there's a few of you that I just could not bear to have on my team because these are slackers. Like Holly, I know you're my best friend, but I'm a winner and I feel like you're a loser. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's fucking charming. I'm meant to be your best friend. Marnie, I just think you lack work <laughs> ethic. Charlotte took this approach where she's telling them why she doesn't want them on her team. Charlotte, you are going to end up with some of these people. If I do end up on your team, I'm going to deliberately do fuck all. I'll sabotage if the fuck out If I go on his team, I'm going to work so hard to win you. Let's just do rock, paper, scissors. Whoever wins, picks first. One, two, three! Oh. <laughs> Boom! The first win of many. So the first person I'm picking for Team Charlotte, they're very hard-working, they're quite good-looking. Quite, must be. <laughs> I am going to choose... Aaron. If you really want right. to go, let's go. Who's the first person to get picked? 
obviously fucking me. I'm definitely not that fat kid in school left on the line at the end. Welcome to Team Charlotte, Aaron. Not nah, Aaron. I don't care about Aaron. It's fine. <laughs> My first person I'm picking because obviously we're going to be in a club. I need someone who brings a party. It's definitely me. I mean, it's got to be me. And that first person is Chloe. <laughs> Chloe, is he taking the piss? <laughs> it's me! I've never, ever been picked first for anything. I feel like a legend. The second choice would be on Team Charlotte is... Nathan! If I'm honest, I don't want to be on Charlotte's team. She just threw Marnie and Holly under the bus. I don't want to work for you. <laughs> is this a joke? No, I just, I just don't like what you just did to these. Take the fuck down and get over here. My second team member is... Marnie. Na, 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 na. Go on, <laughs> What the fuck? One person goes, another person goes. I'm still sat here twiddling me fucking thumbs. So my third member of Team Charlotte is... Marnie! Fuck off! Finally, I've been picked. Third from the fucking bottom. So my third pick is... Right, it's awkward now because we didn't want Holly on our team and she's in the last two, so someone's going to have to have her. Chantel. <laughs> Thank you. Come on, Chantel. Shit! Now I'm left with Holly! Oh, fuck I didn't even get picked. I just got put on Charlotte's team. What a fucking job. We're going to win, guys. We're, We're going to win. win. Now both teams have been chosen, I suppose we've just got to let the best woman win because we all know it's going to be me. Please! Team meeting. We need to get the ball rolling. We don't have much time. I'm really pleased with my team. Are you sure about that? Because you didn't even fucking pick us. That's in the past now. We need to move forward. That's what winners do. Stop whinging. You're on a winning team here, and a winning team needs a winning theme. And that shit rhymes, bitches. Team. What are you thinking? How about the 80s? Everyone loves the 80s. Come I'm on, all the 90s. Some flares. That's shite. I'm not going to lie. I think it's crap. I think we're going in the past. We want to move it to the future. Forward. We're like robots. So what <laughs> then? What Let's are you in thinking? The I've got it. I mean, my mum always said I was a genius. But this time around, I've pulled it out of the bag. Picture this, right? We're at the party, right? There's crowns everywhere. There's a huge throne. And then there's corgis. And this corgis. And the name is, right, ready? Royal Rumble. Oh. I actually like that. Actually, we, I genuinely yeah, I like, like that. that. We've come up with our theme, and it's Royal Rumble, and that's pretty fitting because we are Geordie Royalty. Aaron, shall me and you go get the props? Oh, then. Let's fucking do this. <laughs> <laughs> Boys room because we need a plan. Right, well, I have to say, I'm very happy that I've, I was on this team. It'll be mint. We all get on the same. We all got a good banner. I can be the flirt. Chantel can be the dancer. What the hell can I be? What do you want to be? I'm 18, because I'm very good at You're very funny. Right, OK? And I'll have them fucking giggling. If they're not giggling, then they're not coming in. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly did not intentionally want to have a team full of girls, but I am pretty pleased. What were your favourite team? What would you feel sexiest in? What would you feel the best in? Be what? You would look better at a pair of red and red Little lifeguard so... things. Could you? That could be I've good got one. a red costume, but I don't know about the belly. So this is what I've been thinking. Because I've got three girls in this, okay. right? Just... Like Charlie's Angels kind of thing. Like, no, like, so like heaven and like hell. So I'd like, say a devil. Yeah. With, like, so like it's me with like three angels. angels. That is a mint idea. Gary has chosen angels and devils. And I know his idea will definitely win. But I want to see your best Charlie's Angels pose. <laughs> What's that? What's that? What a pistol? <laughs> I think we make wicked angels. Gary, you're a lucky lad. <laughs> Mate, Marty, we need to go get outfits, girls. Stop making on props. The themes are set. Now both teams need to put their parties into action. Mm. You having fun? It looks like candy floss. We need guests. We're throwing a party tonight for work, and I need every single person there because I want to fucking win. We need costumes. These with stockings. Look at these. These. We need props. Oh, my God! We need to put on the best parties that Newcastle has ever seen. All right, Team Charlotte. And 
I've got these wings for us. I've got stockings. And then I've got more stockings. You've got up. I want to walk in that club with the girls and think, boom, deal with me. Fucking hell, I didn't know I was going shopping with Hugh Hefner. It's time to get back to the house and get ready for the night's parties. The board is bringing. Who the fuck is that? Hello. Hi, Anna. Anna, you're right. Just wanted to let you know I've got a surprise coming over to you very soon. What? Anna's just called and she's got a surprise for us and it's on its way now. What the hell's it gonna be? Goose! That was Anna. She's got a surprise for us and it's on its way right now. All this party planning, I've forgotten about the surprises. I love surprises, me. There's a call. What the hell is going on? One door's just gone there. Oh. It's a new person. Please, please, please be a pure fake new bird. It's a new bird, it is. This has literally made my life. Who's team gonna win? It's Team Shad versus Team Gary's. There's only one way to get the party started, and that's loads of necking on. Sit in the This park contains loads more really strong language, sex talk, and scenes plus some very aggressive behaviour. So this is not for you, best turnover. You have been warned. Told Nathan, there's a surprise on the way. What the fuck could it be? It is. It is. I'm fucking back! Oh God. Ah! Guess who's fucking back? <laughs> this has got to be a dream. Like, what the fuck? Sophie has just walked through the fucking door. Just that Sophie's back. She's the first friend I made in this, and to see her face walk through that door, I just can't describe how happy I am. I'm back, baby girl. Baby girl, I'm back. It's been so long since I've wanted this home to happen, and I'm finally back. I'm back with me best friends. I am absolutely buzzing to be back. I'm young, I'm fun, and I'm full of fun. Sophie. Boom, 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 boom. I was the worst slut ever. <laughs> this is for me and you. Put it away! You can lend it your own. And then I got with my boyfriend, Joel. <laughs> it's like a tornado's gone up right up the arsehole. <laughs> Me and Joel always had the ups and downs. Mr. Zoma. But you did. Fuck off. But the girls were always there for us. <laughs> Especially my best friend, Charlotte. <laughs> <laughs> We've had loads of fights. Fucking day. But be like, so what? But we have always made up. Can't wait to get mortal and have a wicked time with me Geordie family. <laughs> and has brought me back to help them lot with the club night competition. And I tell you what, this is right up my street because I am the fucking party. Where's everyone else? Where's Marnie? Where's Gary? Went out chopping for some props and party tonight. I cannot wait. Until Gary walks through like oh. a You have to hide. Oh, what about if I'm just in the phone box like that, Ami? We'll hide Sophie in the phone box so when Gary and Molly get back, she can surprise them. This is going to be Raj. I cannot wait to see my baby cousin Molly's face. I suppose it'll be all right to see Gary's as well. We get back from shopping and everyone's lying on the fucking sofa. Get up, we've got a party to plan. I don't think that 
I could have ever had a bigger and better surprise. This has literally made my life. Sophie was there as an original. She was there at the store. She was like a little sister. Like, it's just so nice to see her. <laughs> Wait a second. Whose team does she go on? Mine or Charlotte's? If Charlotte got five, I got four. So you've got to join my team, so it's five and five. Gary's a man down, so it's only fair that I go on his team. Sorry, Charlotte, but now he's got me. Your team is going down. We are going to be this bitch! Sophie's now on my team. I've got all these girls. We've got the costumes. We need to get ready. It's competition time. So excited for tonight now. Buzzing. It still doesn't feel real that Sophie's sitting with us, getting ready for tonight. Do you know what? Even if I didn't win tonight, I'd still be happy. That's a lie. I'd be absolutely distraught. I feel so good that I've got my cousin here. Double trouble. Me and my Sophie in the past have always got up to so much trouble when we went out together. And the fact that we're on the same team, we're going to be so naughty. Team, you're going down, bitch! Never! I look like King Long Schlong. Let's get a peeve and get out of here. Now that we're ready, there's no time to lose. It's Team Charlotte's Royal Rumble versus Team Gary's Heaven and Hell. <laughs> and there's still so much to do, so we better get fucking cracking. We only give her a couple of hours to get this shit together. So we need to get in the club as quick as we can and make sure these parties run fucking smoothly. We get in the club, then it's time to put my angels to work and get this club looking heavenly. We need the prop set. We need the Jaeger's prep. We need this place looking as good as we do. Please let there be some guests. Fucking get in. The guests have started to arrive. Let's get this Royal Rumble fucking bouncing. Welcome, welcome, my Royal subject. I know I love you, Gary, but tonight we are winning and you are going down. I hope you are all ready to get royally fucked. And there's only one way to get the party started, and that's loads of necking on. I think Team Charlotte are going to take the fucking lips of Team Gary. Oh, this bastard girl's going to be shitting each other if you that. Thank fuck loads of angels and devils have turned up. Time to get this party started and get off our wings. Chose me first to bring the party, but I can give myself getting more of fuck. Charlotte hates losing. She's absolutely devastated that Sophie's on my team. I already feel like I'm out in front. <laughs> Our team is ticking along like clockwork. Charlotte's on the mic, I'm handing out shots, Nathan's mingling, Marty's necking on, and Holly is standing there doing fuck all. No one want to be on their team. <laughs> Holly, that's not true. I'm not going to work hard for you. You didn't want me on your team, so you can fuck off. The girls start a massive dance-off. Oh, here come Liz. My girls can't dance. I feel sorry for Charlotte. She's totally missed out. Sophie is the ultimate entertainer. We are going to win. Yeah. <laughs> 
Tonight has been a success, but I've just spotted Anna. She's the one that decides the winning team tonight, and I hope to God that she's seen we're killing it. Gary's Angels have now gone west. You like my nigga? Hello. Please, Anna, let us win. So the winner is... Shh. You're only getting a kiss. Oops! Don't show This part has got loads more talk about sex and the usual very strong language. So please stop watching if this isn't for you. So far, the night has been a success, but I've just spotted Anna. She's the one that decides the winning team tonight. In, and it's chuffed with the party. Oh, ha, Gary Beadle, I bet your night sucks a donkey's dick. So far, the party's going absolutely wicked, but I'm doing all the work, and new Gary should not be surrounded by all his hot girls. One of the girls seems very into Gary, and it'd be interesting to see if he goes there. He better up higher. Gary, I'm impressed. And Charlotte will be too. I'm gonna walk away. I'm gonna walk away. Tonight's been tough. There's been so much temptation, but I don't want to fuck things up with Charlotte. Angels, let's get some party games going. Right, girls, girls. The girls have been doing so good, but they're all lightweights. Shit. Let's go, let's Out of the corner of my eye, I can literally see Anna in the club. Girls, get your fucking act together. No! Ah! Ah! Come on, party. What? Doesn't everyone say that at the boss? Anna, you're getting nice to Anna, you've got nice Nice one, Marnie. I just hope that Anna has got a sense of humour and then she can actually see we'll put on a wicked party. I've had a wicked night tonight, but I am yet to make sure that we win. I will do fucking anything to beat them divvies. I'm massively impressed at Marty. He's been nicking on left, right and centre. Now, let's get back to the house and wait for Anna to call with the results. I literally love the new girls because they're nearly as rad as me. Gary's Angels have now gone west. You like my nigga? Well, that's quite hard for you, you know. So, we have to see it, Fanny. Tonight's been absolutely amazing, but I just hope that my little angels, who are now rolling around absolutely paralytic, haven't fucked this up for me. Let's go home and wait to hear the results. Tonight has been wicked. I actually can't wait to find out who's won. Team Charlotte! I'm here waiting for Marnie to come in, and Gary carries her through the door. It looks like them naked cuddles are out the fucking question. <laughs> Listen to how good this is for you. I cannot wait to tell Charlotte that Gary Hide a girl at work, she's gonna be buzzing. This girl said this with Gary. Uh, and he's like, to the girl, no, stop it, get off his. Chantal's telling us that Gary turned down a girl. This means it's getting serious. He was like, nah, me and Charlotte have got a thing. <laughs> Gary turned down a girl tonight because he's got a thing with me. I mean, he might as well just be wearing a ring.
shit. This has got to be Anna with the results. Oh! I'll get it, I'll get it, I'll get it. Hello? Shh. Yep. Please, Anna, let us win. Right, everyone, shut up! <laughs> right. That phone call was Anna. It's the moment of truth, the big reveal. So the winner is... Fucking hell, he's taking his time. You're not fucking Dermot! Charlotte. <laughs> This is the first time I've ever beat Gary Beadle at anything. Oh, I'm fucking buzzing. What now to Team Charlotte? Get in! For fuck's sake, man. Charlotte, enjoy it while you can. You might win the battle, but I will win the war. How'd you fucking feel about that? I'm absolutely devastated. I just wish I drank as much as Marnie so I was passed out so I'd have to listen to these divvies. Uh, 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 who are you? Tonight has been unreal. Our team won, Sophie's back, and I didn't totally hate work. Maybe this time round, I won't be such a miserable bitch. Why you can stop that? It's been a pure lethal night. I'm absolutely mortal, and I cannot resist a cheeky spoon with Marty. Night, night, Nathan, love you. Night, night, love you too. Tonight's win, and hearing that Gary was a good boy, I'm in a pretty good mood. How are Gary? Take us to the shag pad. I probably shouldn't be sleeping with the competition, but I've actually really missed Charlotte tonight, so fuck it. Can I just ask one question? <laughs> <laughs> Did you actually think you were ever going to win it? <laughs> Who were Gary? I'm sorry you had to be a loser, but how about I let you kiss the winner? But you're only getting a kiss, Gary. Born. We are gonna ban me and Charlotte are now seeing each other. Fucking hell, it's James! Guess who's back in the house? Jim! Oh my god, it's like all the originals are coming back. Aaron! I'm finally having sex with Aaron. Surprise! Hey, fucker! What the fuck is that? Oh,